And hello again, Internet. Well, here we are with a new layout for my PlayStation 2 setup. And as I'm sure you can see by the title, we are looking at Shadow of the Colossus today. Now, I've completely adjusted this layout a bit. I'm hoping it works because there were some issues with the way things were set up a little bit before. For example, it was apparently doing the wrong resolution when I was bringing this signal in originally, so my older recordings are slightly off, and that might explain why there were some bars where there shouldn't have been on the screen. Let's see if this actually corrects it, or if I have just made the biggest mistake and squished everything around like I should not have. As you can see, we've got my uh, logo up in the corner now, brand new logo, yay! Hey, Sawsmith! And also, you can now see that there's chat! Awesome! That's going to be for the older games here, for console games and maybe my DOS box stuff. For things that are 16 by 9, that's probably not going to be the case. But yeah, just started it up here, opened this game up for the first time. This is Shadow of the Colossus, and it's a very interesting game, done by the same guys that did Ico, among others. They're... They are some of the more creative people in gaming, it's in game development, or at least they were back in the day. With games like this, that a lot of people seem to think is some kind of Zelda clone and adventure game, when truth be told, what this game really is, is a puzzle game at its core. You see, it's a game that is comprised entirely out of boss fights. But these boss fights, and I'm looking like those bars are still on the sides of the screen, so adjusting the resolution might not have been a good idea. We'll see if it distorts the image when we get in there. But as I was saying, this game is comprised entirely of boss fights. I believe 12 of them, if I'm not mistaken. But each of these bosses is effectively a puzzle where you are trying to figure out how to maneuver yourself across the uh, Colossus to get to the point to end it. To get to its weak spot for massive damage, historically accurate. <laughs> ah, cables everywhere. Driving me nuts right now. I'm trying to adjust things. There we go. And yeah, we're watching the opening cinematic here because, well, I haven't seen this in years. Now, this is also an interesting game in that it's one of the few... PlayStation 2 games that actually had a demo released. Because, you know, PlayStation 2, you couldn't exactly go and download demos, even though it did later have a hard drive and a modem. So, I actually, which I actually do have installed here, so I could play if I wanted to. It's got dial up and can connect through my internet hub. You know. Wi-Fi cable, or not Wi-Fi, yeah, Wi-Fi cable, hey, <laughs> no, uh, it's got a network cable connection and all that fun stuff, unlike the early Dreamcast, which originally shipped with just a dial-up modem, and if you wanted a high speed, you had to buy that separately, well, you had to buy this one separately too, but it came with both, anywho, yes, there was a demo disc released for this game, which I don't know if it was on like one of these magazines that had the demo discs, or if it was its own demo disc. I'm sure I have a copy of it somewhere, I just have no idea where. But it came with the first of the bosses, and believe me, ever since I played that demo, mm, I've been wanting to play more of this game, because this game is amazing. I just don't know why my video input is kind of messing the signal up a little bit here. It should be 4x3. It should completely fill that screen. Why isn't it? Well, I mean, the top and bottom is because of the cinematics. I'm just wondering why there's bars on the sides. That is very distracting. Yeah, see there? It's it's not filling up the full screen. Ah, well, whatever. Whatever. We're going to start a new game here. But yeah, the demo disc included the first of the bosses, and uh, it was really fun, really well done. And it well, kind of showed what this game was all about. Caught a lot of people's attention, and uh, been wanting to play this ever since. And I did flip the coin. 
it was heads to play a good game, tails to play a bad one, and it came up heads, thankfully. Which, I really did want to play Fallout this time out, but when this one was brought up, it's like, yeah, yeah, that, that's on my backlog. I've got the disc. I've been waiting to play it for years. Decades, even. Well, a decade, at least. Actually, probably a decade and a half at this point. See, this version was released in 2005, so yeah, more than a decade. This is the Greatest Hits version, by the way. So if there was any updates to the game between them, I have the updated version. They did do that sometimes. But the backlog isn't just about bad games. It really is about the backlog. These are the games that I've been needing to get around to for a while, and every once in a while... <laughs> old Gameplay Wasteland. Every once in a while. I don't even have to repeat this now. You guys can all see the chat. You see it down there? You know what they said. I don't have to repeat it now. What am I doing? <clears throat> but. Train of Thought just died. Amazing. I have a very one track mind, and as soon as anything tries to adjust it, the whole thing derails, and there's a big train wreck in my head, and it gets pretty noisy, honestly. Twisting metal, screams, the smell of burning bo- I mean, hi, how are you? But, um, no, yeah, the backlog, sometimes it really is about getting to the classics that I just missed. And I have a habit of ignoring those for the stream, it seems. There are a few that I played, I went through Descent and stuff like that. So, I have been going back and playing some actual classics, not just games that are notoriously bad. And, you know, these graphics do not look very impressive today. Let me tell you, for PlayStation 2, this looks bloody amazing. And I think it actually helped the fact that stuff's kind of blurred in this. I have no idea what he's doing. Because this is a very strange way to bury your girlfriend. No, I think he's supposed to be trying to revive her, because, you know, hero thing. That looked awful, but I assure you it was actually pretty impressive back in the day, the way the blanket did that. <laughs> it was pretty bad. Oh. Alright, so what have we here? Okay, well, okay, you're, you're gonna get the uh, nonsense voice, that, that's fine. Oh, this should be fun. Oh, just get to the point already! Greetings! Oh, yeah, she is dead, so we are trying to revive her. Of course we are. Yeah, it is tend to be dead, but I don't have that many followers, so... But I am always glad to chat with the people, so hey. And now you guys get to see it too. Hey! No bots here, so... None of the bot commands will work. Honestly, I... <laughs> I had an old MIRC bot like 20 years ago that I built. If I really wanted to do bot stuff, I'd almost want to rebuild one of those. Okay, do I get to fight these things? No, of course not, because this game is all about boss fights. This is all just story stuff, so I can put my controller down and go blah 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 blah. What's going on here? But yeah, I haven't I haven't put up any bots yet. I need to one of these days. Just kind of figure out how. Oh, spooky! He just banished all the shadows with his sword by pointing it at them.
There is a game behind all of this, isn't there? Yes, I have the Master Sword. You may call me Link. What? Oh, you have an ancient sword. You must be mortal. What? Control the souls of the dead. What is going on here? Your soul is mine. Now, I do wonder if... I wonder if this is like Japanese language or what. Yes, Shark! I actually did choose this game. Actually, the coin chose it for me. I flipped the coin and it said, No, you're going to play the good game. Also, how do you like the snazzy new setup for these older games? Complete with chat! Woo! The other choice was Fallout Brotherhood of Steel. Because the language was made up for this game. It's not like they were doing it in Japanese or anything. Well, I actually appreciate that. I wonder how intense it was if they were just doing gobbledygook or if they actually did manage something for it. It's a pretty basic look, yeah, but it's something, I mean. I am trying to up my game up just, just a little bit. Not a whole lot, but... For doing stuff like XCOM, it's, I'm not gonna have the chat up because that fills the entire screen. Whereas this works for the 4x3s. But then again, XCOM is just a side game anyway, so it doesn't matter. Oh. There's, there is supposed to be a game here at some point. I mean, I've only been sitting here for 10 minutes waiting to do something. Defeat the Colossi. Yes, thank you. Oh, yeah. Yes, you get to destroy the world just so you can save her. How does that feel? Good use of music. The aesthetics in this game are great. Yeah. As I said, the graphics here don't look very good compared to, d to today's standards. But on PlayStation 2, this game was jaw-droppingly good. He is definitely think. I agree, Sawsmith. Head to the plate where the sword's light gathers. There we go. I say a very, very interesting creative game, and I can't wait to finally get into the whole thing. I have played part of it before. I think I got to the Water Colossus. You'll see that one, don't worry. You'll see which one I was at. Oh, I don't talk in the chat, but you guys are hearing me. Yeah. Oh, hey, I, I, can't, I do have control now. Yay, I can move. Oh, okay, I need to reverse that. Options. I can change the screen ratio. I'm not going to. I also, I do have the cables for progressive scan. Somewhere, but I have no idea where they are, so I'm not going to worry about it. Uh, vertical. Yeah, 
can you stole it to save her? That makes sense. Okay, horizontal camera controls should be inverted. Probably the other ones also. We'll have to adjust this. Okay, confirm. Back out. Double check. Okay, that'll work for now. Duh. Hmm. Falling down there looks like it'd be a bad idea. Oh, I'm supposed to fall down. Oh, I, I called my horse. Get on the horse. Get on the horse. I don't don't attack your horse. Okay. First things first, figure out what the hell I'm doing. I'm in a sunlit place. That's the direction I need to go. Okay. Can I get on my horse, please? I, I just pressed that and I jumped. Game. There you go. No, no. Go, go the other way. Go that way. Um, forward. X. Horse, jump off this and die. Horse doesn't want to jump off and die. Okay, I'll jump off and die then. No, I don't want to hold the sword up. I want to call the horse again. That's jump. That's swing the sword. Yo, horse, get over here. Am I actually looking back toward my horse right now? Is that what's going on? Horse! There's my horse! About time you showed up. You're being lazy. No, get on the horse! Okay, the controls in this are a bit of a pain in the ass. Didn't these guys also do, what is that game, The Last Guardian or whatever it is, with that big cat dragon thing? That way. Oh man, I'm going to be fighting the controls this entire game. Controls are reasonable, but we're impatient nowadays. I mm, to a degree. Yeah. It does feel like I'm a lot of struggling against them, though. Where I try to do one thing, and the controls are just like, nope, do something else. <sighs> Although it is true, I mean, we are used to more tightened controls these days. Okay, now it teaches us how to climb. This is important because, you know, puzzle game. All right, off the horse. Upsy daisy. Oh, R1. R1. Jump. R1. There we go. Honestly, I kind of want to change the. Ah, no, no. Ugh. I kind of want to change the jump button to something else. No, climb, climb, climb. There we go. Yeah, I want to switch that button. Options, button configuration, jump to that. Control horse. Better. There, there we go. Now my jump button makes more sense to me. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Yeah, there we go. Climb, you fool.
Um, I don't know if Twitch does. And honestly, this way is better. Ah, climb. This way is better than it used to be than having black on both sides of the screen. Oh, okay, I have to crouch under this. Oh, wait. There we go. Now, you see, in a good game, it would recognize that my buttons were changed and not tell me to use a button that's not it anymore, not proper anymore. Well, I'm not getting up that, so I'm to climb around. And jump across. Hey, we made it. Yeah, this game is really old, but that's stuff that should have been in here. And there's the first boss colossus puzzle. I'm going to continue to harp on the fact that this is, at its core, a puzzle game. I don't know, that's a good one. Can I shoot it? No. Oh, there's the bow. Oh, I think it noticed me. Oh, it noticed me, all right. Okay. Last Guardian. Okay, so they are they did do the Last Guardian. Gotcha. Nope. No. What? I wasn't even anywhere near you. Reflect light onto the Colossus till... Its weaknesses are revealed. Well, I'm trying. It's not letting me. Up at the top of the head. Of course it is. Oh, God. I don't want to be there. Roll! Climb onto this hair. Come on. Hair. It. Uh, there we go. And... Whoop, that's not working. That's the spot there. Let's stab the leg. Down, go. Oh, shit. <sighs> come on, come on, come on. And yes, you see I have a grip meter over there, too. <sighs> Hit the thing, you fool. Well, I've been trying to stab it. It didn't want me to. No, I fell on purpose. I, I fell off. I got the grip meter. Don't you worry. Come on. Hit it with the freaking sword. You're right there. You are right there. Knock it down. Climb! Climb! There's going to be a lot of that in this game. Frustration over things not working. Now, isn't it nice and convenient that this Colossus has a platform built onto his back? I mean, who'd ever have imagined that? No, no, climb, you idiot! What are you doing? No, no, no! The hair, it's right here. It is right here. Climb up it. Climb! Don't dick around. 
Oh, this is annoying. Boom! Bloody! Restore my grip, and... Stab again. Should be able to get another one here. See? These things are easy. I don't know why anyone's ever had a problem with them. Um... Congratulations, you just defeated the tutorial. Alright. Oh, now I've been infected with the, with the T-Virus. What would be the C-Virus for the Colossus? Well, that was... Oh, these controls are frustrating. <laughs> oh, I'm used to controls that actually do what you tell them to. I mean, this may not be as bad as Ultimate Spider-Man, but it's pretty annoying. Why, yes, I would like to save. Thank you very much. I mean, this layout would be a bit better if chat were more active, I admit. Maybe when I do get more people, hey. But at least now you can see, you guys can see the chat, so it does look at least a little bit better than it used to. Yeah, Shark, I agree. He really does. Really does. But it used to be that the view would just be... I used to just have the game window centered on the screen, so you'd have black on both sides. I think it looks better off to the side with the chat available. Yeah, these read speeds are not very good. I mean, the entire memory card is only, what, 8 megs? <laughs> and hell, the entirety of the uh, other ones, the PlayStation 1 cards, you can, fit, you can fit, I think, several of them on a single floppy disk. I could pull a thing out right now and find out. It is 8 megs. Yep. And, ah, come back here. Come back here, card. I need you. <laughs> Kaboom! Oh, yeah. Now, how did I get transported back here? Hmm... Yeah, next area. Thy next foe is... It moves slow. They all kind of move. Actually, no, they don't. So that, that, that would not be... Of course, these statues don't really help us with that. Uh, can I... There we go! It's like I can move the camera, but I couldn't walk. Can I go downstairs? I can go upstairs. I want to go downstairs. Hi, horse! You know what? Hold on, horse. Horse! Oh, right, right. right. Let's use the right... <laughs> no, don't! Oh, my God! Let's see if I can do this without jumping to my death this time. Hey, look! I found stairs! Find an altar. And thy wounds shall be healed. Okay, that would be useful. I will never remember that now. Okay, where am I going? Sword. Sword. That's 
not your sword, dude. Sword. That's also not your sword. Oh, it's a save point. Okay, well, that's more useful then. Fine, I'll get off the horse. I don't have the sword in my hand. That's why. Do. Okay, I guess I go that way. Back on the horse. You know, not behind the horse. On. <sighs> Get used to seeing that. Are they still selling those? <laughs> See, here's here's something that's nice. If you have a PlayStation 3, I don't know if it works with a 4 and all that, but they actually sold a converter that converts PlayStation 1 and PlayStation 2 memory cards to USB. In fact, you don't even need a PlayStation 3. You could probably do those to get it onto your own hard drive. Okay. Oh, God, no. Am I going to have to climb the damn tower again to cross this bridge? I am, aren't I? All right, let's go back to the tower, climb up it, climb up this bridge. This is dumb. Do not trust those. The um, expanded memory memory cards, especially PlayStation 1, PlayStation 2, what they did is a lot of times they actually compressed the memory is how they supposedly got the multiple pages. Well, if you had a game that already compressed the data, and then the memory card tried to compress it again, you could ruin your entire memory card and lose every save on it. I had one of those back on PlayStation 1, and had this nice 15-page memory card. You know, it basically had 15 memory cards on it. This horse is very difficult to control. I just want everyone to know this. But yeah, I had one of those that had these 15 pages. Thank you, Mad Cats. And I was playing uh, Wild Arms with it. And eventually I got some extra memory cards. I was like, okay, I'm going to start backing up my save games. So I started doing that, backing up the saves. Yeah, the horse is annoying. You know what? Heck with the horse. Bye-bye, horse. I'll do this on my own, and then I'll call you when I'm there. I started backing up my saves, and, of course, like the idiot I was, instead of backing up the page I was on, I left that page to go back up the rest of the pages, and tried to come back to it, and the memory card was like, Nope, corrupted! So I lost all my Wild Arms save, and I wasn't done with that game yet. So that's another one that's on my backlog that I've never finished. And I could do it here. But it's a role-play game. And those things are extremely long and annoying. In fact, the majority of my PlayStation 1, PlayStation 2 games on the backlog are role-play games. So, yeah. That's why it's actually better off just to get an official 8 meg. Or, you know, official PlayStation 1 if you have PlayStation 1. Actually, if you have PlayStation 1, just emulate. It works so much better. Okay, I guess I'm not going this way! Oh, okay, so killing salamanders will give you extra grip power. That makes sense. Suicide time! Whee! Jump into the water! That's what the pool of water's for. That's not what the pool of water's for! Okay, this is not one of those games where if you find a pool of water down at the bottom of a jump and you land in it, you're fine. Nope! <laughs> well, I was kind of flailing away. Maybe I have to actually dive into the water. Oh my god, I bet I have to dive. Oh, this is going to be awful. Oh, <laughs> Shark, why did you make me play this game? 
fool! I know, right? Who would have thunk it? I'm so used to video game conventions where it's like, oh, it's water down there. It's safe to jump. No! <sighs> Aaron. Well, I guess it's time to stumble blindly along. Can I please get back to playing? This is my punishment for failing. Is I have to sit here and watch this cutscene. <laughs> it's video games! They're not supposed to make sense! I'm climbing on the back of giants and stabbing them with a sword to kill them. Okay, I'm gonna actually save it outside this time, if that's a save point down there, so that I don't have to watch the cutscene when I fail again. Because, oh, I'm going to fail a lot. I'm going to fail a whole lot. <laughs> nice, nice. Come on, get on the horse. Thank you. Good horsey. No, go. No, no! Oh, controls! I'm gonna be fighting that the entire game. Yeah. XCOM usually lets me do what I want. Yeah. Doo -doo -doo. Oh, man. Yes, you told me this before. Glad we're doing a save spot, though. Alright, let's... No, no, horse. Go, go, to... no, okay, fine. This game does not like me. Hi! Uh, hi? Pray? No, I... Hand, yeah, see... Ah, there we go. Yes, I would like to save. No, 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 I'm not dying again just to play the cutscene. Oh. Well, I, if I throw this controller, I'd lose my controller. It's the only place this new controller I have that actually works. No, don't get fucking horse again, damn it. Yeah. Uh, you're as bad as them last night trying to get me to kill my own unit in, in uh, XCOM. Ah, blow that thing up, blow that thing up. My guy standing next to it, blow it up anyway. Yeah. Yeah. Ah, the internet. Schadenfreud sustains us. I think that's how it's pronounced. It's a bird! Hi, burb. It also bugs me that the horse doesn't go at the center of the camera. I could not because I was standing in it! Okay, obviously I can't cross this from here. Well, the thing is, we, we're, <laughs> we're using the names of players, and that was my guy that was standing there, too, so I didn't want to kill myself with it. Okay, well, um, I guess I'm going to go down this. Yeah. This looks like a way down. Ho! Oh, okay. You just want to watch me su suffer, Shark. Admit it. 
See, now everyone's learning just how delayed I am with the chat. Could sent back in time to get some resources. Oh, wow. You figure out the name of that game, I'd be interested to hear it. Back in time, get resources before the Russians did. No creating units. Only giving them jobs and keeping them alive. That does sound pretty cool. Well, there's that seaside cave I was warned about. Come on. No, no. Horse, go. Horse, go. I have to push the horse make go button. Okay, first off, sword. It's down there, isn't it? Yep, it's down there. Okay, so I gotta keep going further down. No, 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 don't, don't. Horse, don't go straight off the edge, please. I have no idea what this horse is called, so I'm just gonna call it a Treyu. Nothing bad can come of that name. <laughs> Agro. It's an interesting name. Okay, so I'm down at the bottom of this area. Where is this cave? There. Cave. Cave. Is there a cave? Ah, uh, ah, uh, there we go. There's the cave. Hey, I found a cave. Does the cave have a thing outside of it? Whoa, whoa. Okay, horse says no. Horse does not want to play with the cave. Oh, hi there. You're a friendly looking bloke. Alright, oh, I guess I don't need the horse right now. Horse doesn't want to be around here anyway. So, weak spot, weak, turn around, turn around, weak spot, weak spot, weak spot, weak spot. Uh, oh, it's butt. It's weak spot is its butt. Excellent. Okay, it knows I'm here. Where do I get up? Music's good. I'll give the music that. Alright, do I have to hit with my... Alright, fine. Let's see what you got. That didn't do it. Oh, okay! I see it. Go backwards, you fool. Not forward. Cute! I have to get the hoof! Oh, oh, there we go. Climb! Climb! There we go. Weak spot under the hoof. That's an interesting place for it. Of course you're not going to help me. It's more fun figuring it out anyway. You're doing me a favor there. I am so going to fall off this thing before I get up to that platform. Because it keeps jerking me around. Come on, up, up, over to the platform so I can get some rest. Don't... What are you doing? What are you doing? Rest. Grab it. Whoa! Not a happy giant horse. 
Let's try to get back around to this other platform over here. Get, climb back on, you fool. I don't think I'm going to make it this far. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Get up, 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 up. Higher, 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 hurry, 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 hurry. Before you fall off, before you fall off, get somewhere you can stand. Oh. Well, I can kind of stand up here right now, get my grip back. Now, these early ones are fairly easy. It's the later ones that are really annoying. After all, it's still trying to teach us how to play the... Are you not... Can I not crawl around to that from here? Really? There we go. There we go. Okay. Can I stand here? Yes, I can. No! No! Woo! I have got to start standing, get my grip back. <laughs> oh, yeah, that would have sucked. Wait, wait. Oh, crap. It's going away. Oh, great. You've got another weak spot, don't you? It's probably going to be up by the head. Can I hold up my sword and find it? Whoa, 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 whoa. Do you have a different weak spot? You do. Where is it? Well, let's try to crawl down and around this thing. Can I from here? Or am I going to fall off if I try? I'm assuming the next weak spot is up near the head, so let's go to it, if I can. Back to the shoulder over here. Probably going backwards. Yeah, I don't see a way around from here. Stumbling the video game. Ah, there we go. Ah, splat. All right, I actually do want to back off and try to find out where the weak spot is now. Where are you? Where are you, weak spot? It's not the butt again. No, it's not the butt. Is it underneath it? Where is it? Where is it? Where is it? Only game you should play drunk. See, again, I'm doing the whole repeating the chat thing, even though I ha have it here. No, you're, you're near the front somewhere. Just let's get back to the bow. So that when you lift up one of these hooves, I'll be able to shoot you in it. Come on, come on, lift one up, lift one up. Get on! Nope, missed it. Don't get stepped on. Jeez. Ah! Get out of the way. Yeah, 
And try to get back up on the leg here. Jump, catch that hair. All right, back up. I still have no idea exactly where to go. But we're working on it. I'm closer to his butt this time. But his butt's not the one that I want to get. So i got to figure out how to cross... to wherever the new one is. What the hell is the new one? Don't fall off while I'm trying to do that, please. Thank you. Ah, no, nah, don't you dare roll off! How in the world do I get around this? You know, I still love this theme. I mean, like I said, this is just a puzzle game where it's all about trying to get to the guy. <laughs> yeah, exactly. These guys aren't doing anything. Why am I attacking them? All right, all right, all right. Come on, stay on, stay on. Stay on, stay on. How in the heck do I get across this? Am I going to have to crawl through the underbelly? Oh, I bet I am. Yeah, I bet that's what I have to do. I bet it's underneath this... Probably under his chin or something. Okay, let's try this. Ah, this is gonna suck so much. Because there's not gonna be anything... to... stand on down here. It's pure grip. Oh, let's get on that shoulder quickly. Before it's too late. Yes, thank you. I figured that apart. Ah, don't fall off! Get, get, get up there quickly, quickly! No! Oh my god, I made it! Get, no, 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 no. Let me stand here and rest. Die! Stop! Let me rest, you fool! Alright, climb. Grab it. Let's get around. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Ah, ha, ha, ha! Violent, violent! You are very violent! Okay, let's see. You're gonna be down here by the chin or something? Where are you? Where are you? Okay. Not from there. Back up to the shoulder. Back up to the shoulder. Back up to the shoulder. And... No! Splat. Damn. Okay. Can I see it from down here? Turn around. I'd love to. But he keeps doing that. Where, where, where? Is it the eyeballs? Oh, music decided it was done. And the music decided it's back. Okay. No, no, I'll figure this out eventually. I almost feel like I ought to shoot it in the eye. No, 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 no. 
No, quit falling. Ah, splat, down I go. That's what I just said. Oh, I know it does. I'm just trying to get to it. That's the thing with this. Alright, come on, come on. Don't... I like the fact that you can sneak a shot in there like that. Turn around. Stop! Okay, if I've got my camera pointed a certain direction, generally that means that's where I want to aim. Changes the eye's color. That's something. The trick is, I gotta figure out how to get to the head. To the head. Yes, I've heard that already. Thank you. Thank you. Get over here and relax. Because he's got no hair here. I can't crawl across that. Hmm. Try to jump across? Uh, I don't think I can make that, but I'll try. I mean, it can't be any different than what's going on right now. No, don't you fall. Don't you fall. God. Hey, thank you! Oh man, if this guy's asymmetrical, that would suck. No, that way, you fool. Jump! That totally did not work. Splat! Alright, fine. If he's asymmetrical, we'll try this side then. Turn the right damn way. Now he looks pretty ace he looks pretty symmetrical to me. I've already been down there. I'm on the second half of it. No, that one does have more of a horn to it. You're right. Get no, get up there and relax. Uh, he's got spines that I can't get across on. I wasn't able to get up and over those. I mean, maybe I could try again. It, it, ah, don't fall off, you fool! No, it's not looping. There's something going on with the music. It might be that the disc is having some problems reading. To be entirely honest, I think that's what's happening with the music. This is an old system, after all.
And I'm betting... No, oh, this is DVD, so it wouldn't be CD audio. Yeah, but you see there's this ridge here that I don't think I can get up and over. Over. Oh, psh, freaking heck. See, I tried. Well, actually, I didn't try that, did I? Yay! I can get over those things. That was easy. Get used to my trying a lot of bad ideas. That is figuring this game out is a lot of failing and trying bad ideas. It's a puzzle game. Trial and error. Alright, let's... There, yeah, oh, 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 no, oh, grab something, grab something. He's getting, he's getting ornery. Oh, he's getting very ornery. Look at him, he is pissed. All right! It's going to be the end of the second Colossus. It's only taking me an hour. K Kadoosh! Yeah, y'all. And again, these are tutorial ones. They're trying to teach you how to actually play the game, how to get used to stuff happening. Such as... Fool! You can jump over these ridges. Remember? Now we know. Skadoosh. Yes, exactly. And despite the frustration of... Which way am I supposed to go? Which way am I supposed to go? Which, that is the gameplay. I'm having fun. This game is great. Knowing is half the battle. The other half is getting someone else to do it for you. I mean, hi. How are you? <laughs> Sweet. Let's hope I can take on another Colossus. Maybe get two of them done today. Ah, that's not happening. Yeah, thank you, save complete. Thank you. Oh, now there's two corpse shadows standing by my corpse. Boom. Said so if these are the guys that made Last Guardian, it doesn't surprise me because it seems like right up their alley. Giant canopy soars to the oh boy, we got the bird one now. No, it's not the bird one, is it? It'd be great if more people would make these creative games like this. Honestly. Come on, give me my control. I got the camera. There we go. There's the controls. Hi, horse. Yeah, but the way... It's like, wasn't that originally supposed to be like a launch title for PS3 or something? Last Guardian. Yeah, it, it, Trico, of course, I think being the giant cat dragon thing, which, yeah, a lot of work, but it pays off. I mean, that is a very difficult thing to try to make. They made that creature really have some good AI, like the horse in this also. 
probably more complex than people give it credit for. Okay. Where am I going? Where am I going? I am going... That way! So, like, these people have always been doing stuff like that. Ico, for example. Man, you're supposed to be... Isn't that one where you're... Basically a giant escort quest? I don't know, I've never played Ico. I should play more of these guys' games. They're classics. Let's try not jumping off this, this time. That would be fun. No, 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 horse. Horse, where are you going? Horse, this way. I have mad respect for these guys with the games they make. Yeah. Yeah. Hmm. It's fun to play a good game once in a while. Alright. Okay, this is starting to look familiar. Where? Over here. A very interesting way of doing that as well. Oh, there's no way I'm pulling that off. Yeah. It's like, man, I remember having to do that with Epona. Yeah. And Legend of Zelda, and that's hard enough. Yeah. Yeah. That was back when my hands worked. Gotten old. Okay, this does not look pleasant. What's going to happen here? This way. Yeah, don't get old, man. It's from holding the controllers for so long. Especially these little ones like the NES used to have. Oh my god. And the sharp corners! You guys have no idea today. All your controllers have these nice rounded edges. Go look at an NES controller. These corners were sharp, man. Give yourself stigmata playing those games. <laughs> the bird one is a tilter. Uh, like I said, I got up to a boss in the water, I think. I don't know if I managed to beat it. I don't think I did. Okay, yeah, that's where I gotta go. Through... Oh, Salamander. Hey. Yeah. No, no, horse. Off horse. Off horse. Your first was a 2600? I had Pong. Did I kill it? Did I kill it? I killed it! So yeah, I had Pong, I had Intellivision. Get on the dang horse again. Pick up the tail. I've picked up the tail! I think. The white tails. It wasn't white. So did I grab the wrong one then? Get back on the horse. I was just on the horse. You are a very annoying creature. No, Shark, I know you didn't. You did that on purpose. I know you. Shoot me in the back at base. Shoot me at the back at... Oh, 
I'll use the grab button. That works. Okay. Shoot into... I swear I can talk. Shooting me in the back during bank heists. There we go. Words. Words strung together into a phrase. What have we here? Why, that certainly appears to be a thing! There's also no sunlight here, which means no... Quickly finding the weakness. Alright. Sorry, horse. Blorp. 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 Drown. Uh, it's a thing. That's for sure. Beyond that, I have no idea. This does seem like... It might be the place that I... Was not able to complete before. It certainly has those kind of hall markings. I'm gonna fall off this and die, aren't I? Okay, now it's testing whether or not I've remembered what to do. Jump, grab, come around, and do I try to go over this, or do I just jump backwards from here? I think I'm just going to jump backwards from here. Yay! Yay! I didn't fail the test of trying to get to the thing. Oh, this is going to be the bird one, isn't it? Oh, it's going to be the bird one. Game. There we go. Pro in the making. Oh, I don't like the looks of this. Oh, okay, it's not the bird, at least. No, I think this is the... F I think Is this the first real test of whether or not you've been paying attention? That one's got a sword. Okay, where's the weak spot? Your stomach. <laughs> the bird with the five-ton sword, yes. Oh, 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 oh. Don't, don't you push me off the edge yet. I gotta figure out how to get on top of you. Okay, you're gonna try doing that. Nope, that's not a place to grab. God, I love the way it deforms the ground with the footsteps. That's pretty great. Okay, am I going to have to shoot you with an arrow somewhere? Or do I have to try to get you to hit me with a sword? Yo, sword. You got a sword. Swing the sword at me. There we go. Nope, that didn't work. Now it's on the other side of the sword. That still didn't work. Sword does not appear to be the answer. Well, I'm not going to try to abuse glitches like that, but that does sound funny. Alright, i got to knock you down somehow. You can come play with me. Okay, he's not happy. Yeah, I figured it was lay the sword flat. 
because he's stabbing it downward, and that's not going to do anything. On the other hand, I did hit him. So it actually hurts him there, so... It's got to be his weak spot. Whoa, whoa, whoa! That's the edge of the map! That is the edge of the arena I found! Okay, can I get around this and back up, please? There we go. Missed me, you missed me, nay. No, don't, don't do that. Crotch shot! Oh, he's got a cod piece on! Yo, stupid, I'm over here. Well, let's sit here and poke you in the gut with arrows then. That's what you, oh, no, turn around. See, I hate that. Just because I'm facing that way. No, look, I'm aiming this way. That's what I want to hit. even close what are you aiming at dude I'm way over here hey slowpoke hurry up god if I bring him down with arrows that'd be hilarious Okay, I'm again near the edge, so I gotta try to get away from that. Stop doing it that way, you fool. I'm running so far away from this guy, the music's stopping. Armor wear seems brittle. Dude, I'm stabbing its belly with my my little toothpicks. Armor don't seem so brittle to me. That belly, that seems brittle. He's not going to swing this, is he? No, he's going to stab the ground again. He is just not cooperating. There we go. There we go. There we go. Okay, well that did something. Where'd he go? Oh, well, there he is. Get up, you fool! You thank, thank you, camera angle, for not letting me see him. Finally! Moving, moving on up. Now 
Now, they almost always have the weak spot up at the head, but I don't think I can actually get to this one's yet. I don't think this one's actually active yet. Yeah, it might be. There's one. Stand for a bit, get my grip back. Is that one even there anymore? No, I think that one's gone. All right, I think I've I think I've abused the, this weak spot for all it's worth. Now I gotta find another one on him. Well, you're very helpful, Sword. You're very helpful there. Ah ha! I think I dropped down somewhere. Drop down to his back and crawl around. That looks to be appropriate. Look, there's that one on his belly that I've been stabbing for a while. No, no, don't, 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 don't you dare! You know, it'd be nice if he would actually grab when I'm sitting next to the wall of hair instead of having to have me jump up and do it. But it's like, I'm standing right there. Just, just grab it. No, I have to jump. See? I, I I just need to, there. So all I needed to do was get on that, but no. Woo! Take down about one every half hour. I probably did that in the reverse order, too. I was probably supposed to do the belly first, then the head. But it's like, there's always one... Am I stuck underneath him? What the heck was going on there? I bet I was supposed to do it in the reverse order. And the game's going, why are you on his belly, you fool? See, now the camera doesn't know what to do. It can't see me, because I'm supposed to be at his head. Games are weird. I am... I absolutely am. These these colossi probably are holding the world together. So the fact that I'm killing them is going to destroy everything on the planet, all life, just to quote save my girlfriend unquote, which won't matter because I'm going to save her and she's going to die like everyone else. Ah, there's three of them now. I'm sensing a pattern. Oh, wow, what did you find? You were very happy to have found something. Oh, 
Land of the Vast Greenfields, Row of Guiding Grave. So I gotta go fight in the cemetery now. Original War! What system? Is it PC? And if it's PC, is it on GOG? Wow! Did you guys see that? I actually managed to run up and immediately get on the horse! No, 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 where are you going? Yeah. I'm only doing this so that if I die again, when I die again, I don't have to watch the cutscene. GOG or STEAM, either way is good with me. Yeah. Also... It has a Wikipedia page, well that's something. Not on GOG, that sucks. More games need to be on GOG, damn it. Oh god, you know, 2001, it probably doesn't even freaking run anymore. It's gonna be one of those games. What am I doing? I'm doing this. I'm... Oh, hey! I'm not crossing the ravine this time. Yeah. Yeah. I might have to go back and check my video to see if some of the chat messages are getting dropped. And if that's the case, might be some aggressive anti-spam. A little too aggressive. Weren't those PlayStation games? Were they ever on PC? Yeah. Don't get me wrong, it's another series that's supposed to be really good, too. So I want to go that way, so I'm going to try going around these mountains. Yeah. Deleted link, but it shows up in there. Th thank you. Thank you. Steam has it. Sweet. I oh, will definitely check that one out then. Probably wishlist it. Of course, you guys have seen me with RTS games, and you don't want to see me with RTS games. Well, you said it's an RTT still. We'll see. I'll give it a try. No, old games should come down in price. Let's be honest. That's one of the reasons I play old games, because they're cheap. And seriously, just because I didn't play a game 15 years ago doesn't mean it's gotten worse. Okay, sometimes it does. Sometimes it really has. Some games do not age well. Some games, though... Get back here! Oh, it's a black tail. Oh well. Oh wait, what's this? You got another one. Oh, a remake of this game would be good. Especially if they tighten the controls a bit. Well, I'm trying with those. Uh, you know, there might be on PlayStation 3. Again, another deleted link that shows up there. That's annoying. Yeah, it was PlayStation 3, wasn't it? 
Although, as you see, I am playing the PlayStation 2 version. Now, are these salamanders with the white tail, are they going to be white tail before I kill them or after? I'm like, am I just wasting time by going, there's a salamander, slash. Oh, tail's not white. Oh, PS4 remake trailer, okay. See, again, not a white tail. Find the white tail on the save statues. Ah, well. Get back on the horse. Well, in which case, I'll quit cutting off salamander tails, because it's not helping. All I'm doing is extincting the salamander population, and nobody wants that. No. Look, just because my camera goes one way... I'm gonna go in there. Yeah, games get delisted, unfortunately. I hate it when that happens. I really wish the games would stay listed. I mean... Well, some games are classic, and it's good to know them. Good to, good to have info. Good to replay them once in a while. It's like, there are a couple games that I revisit now and then. I don't know how many times I've beaten Duke Nukem 3D. Good God. Okay, that looks like a cliff that'll help me get up the top of this. This will be my last one for the day, assuming I actually beat it in any reasonable amount of time. Because I am coming up on my time here. Yeah. Tales of Asperia. Actually, I need to replay Tales of Symphonia. Oh, come on, really? Wait, what? It's like saying I need to be right here. I used to have Tales of Symphonia on Dream or Dreamcast, uh, GameCube, and it was fantastic. Under me, so I am actually close to it. All right. So I go down and around this then, instead of going up and around. Although, don't make the mistake that I made. I played Tales of Symphonia and right after started trying to play Star Ocean until the end of time. Yeah, Tales of Symphonia blew Star Ocean out of the water. I could barely play Star Ocean thanks to that. In fact, I, I didn't finish it. I got a few planets in. It was like, yeah, I'm done. Where the hell... All right, Agro, let's go. It's actually a reason why I haven't played any of the 
Well, I mean, Tales of Symphonia, that's the thing. Tales of Symphonia was the one I played, and it was so much better than Star Ocean. It's one of the reasons I haven't really played any other strategy games lately since I've been playing XCOM. Oh, nice. So they're still trying to fix um, Original War, huh? Keep it running. Keep it viable. I love seeing that. I am completely lost. I am so good at video games. Can you tell? Oh, uh, by the way, uh, Tales of Vesperia, etc. If you're interested in those games, you might want to look at Steam right now. I'm not kidding. Take a look at Steam. I actually do have Symphonia still on PlayStation 3 as well as Symphonia 2. I'm hoping that the translation kept, because one of the things I really liked about that game is it was one of the few games where one of the characters really spoke proper English. The teacher character there used whom and possessive nouns before ing verbs. It was good stuff. Oh, we're all poor, don't worry. That's why I suggested looking at it now while it's on sale. Is there a cave somewhere? There's got to be something. What am I missing? Yeah. I probably went the wrong way around it. That's what it is. No, oh, man, I hear you. Trust me. Well, Symphonia left a mark on my mind, too. That's why I went back and bought it at um, the PS3 when they had the deal for that. Symphonia 1 and Symphonia 2, because there's apparently a sequel to it. And I was like, oh, dude, sweet, I gotta try this. Of course, I don't play console games anymore, so that's, I just never played them. Yeah. So I'm have to go up there somehow. I'd love to see them do a Humble Bundle with them. Because Bandai has done Humble Bundles before. Yeah. I just think it would be amazing if we get a Humble Bundle with the Tales games. Man, it's inside there. Maybe I won't be finding it. Maybe I'll just be finding the boss. And that'll have to be it for the day. Yeesh. Oh, yeah. I have... See, that's actually kind of a problem with Steam. The whole uh, sale... Yeah, Atlas. Uh, we've discussed Atlas here. Yeah. Atlas brought us Magna Carta. God damn you, Atlas. Oh. But yeah, I, this, oh, the whole sales culture with Steam makes it so hard anymore. Because people are like, yeah, that's a great game. Um, I'll buy it when it's 90% off. Yeah. Like me. Am I going to have to scale a cliff? What's going on? Yeah. 
Ah, so I did. I just went the wrong way. I figured it's like, oh, well, we'll go around this way. No, you have to go around this way. Okay. Progress, I think. I hope. Maybe. Please. Yeah, Atlas. I love Atlas. Yeah, this looks more appropriate. Yep, there we go. Woo! Okay, I remember that thing. That burrow in the ground. That looks familiar. No, oh, give So, like, I love Atlas. They, um, have done a good job of translating and bringing games over. And to the point where there's a whole chain of company that have set up translation studios that can be traced back to Atlas. I just love this chain. You have Atlas, they eventually came out with Disgaea. Disgaea proved so successful that Nipponichi went, Oh, okay, let's, you know, let's do this ourselves. So they started doing it. They brought a bunch of games over to the point where Idea Factory and uh, Compile Heart went, Oh, hey, there's a whole market over here. Why don't we start a studio and bring our games over? And then they started doing it on Steam, even. Which, you know, Hyper Dimension Neptuna games. What, am I not in the sunlight? There's shadow on me. How am I not in the sunlight? Man, I remember back in the Super NES era, RPGs, people, the game companies, especially in Japan, just didn't think American audiences were ready for the very complex role-play games, which, you know, they're not really that complex. In fact, they're generally significantly easier than most other games because... There's not a lot of challenge in them. Let's just be honest here. There we go. There we go. Well. Ooh, a skeletal horse. That's not the first time that's happened, or I mean, not the only time that's happened, but yeah, that's really cool when companies do that. They hire the fan translation, or translators. I honestly am a big fan of any time a company realizes that, oh hey, fans do things, mods, translation patches, etc. We should hire them ourselves. Okay, so there's going to be one up there, and it doesn't show me where the other one is yet. Now I just gotta figure out how to get you to come to me, because wow, I'm not crawling up your legs, obviously. Yeah, my horse is not happy. Probably the bunkers, yeah, but I gotta test things out ahead of time, find out. Yeah, you know what? It looks like those legs can slip inside the bunkers. And get stuck is what it kind of looks like. It's like, why else would there be these geological features over here? Hmm, I wonder.
It certainly looks like these uh, entrances here that it's going to try to shove its foot in and get stuck. Where'd you go? Come on, skeletal horse, let's do this. Come get me. I'm right here. Come and get me. It's not getting stuck. That or their rises, you know, you're supposed to go around the rise. Like this. Wakey, wakey. Okay, now I'm standing on top of this thing. Now what's going to happen? Let's find out. Yeah, come and get me. I'm over here. Yeah, come and get me. I'm right here. I'm standing right here. What are you going to do? What are you going to do about it? Eh? 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 Anything? Okay. Crawling up now. Yes, horse, you're unhappy. I get it. Yo, I'm over here. What are you going to do? What you going to do? I wonder if you can actually kill one of these with arrows if you do it enough times. Come and get me. Come on. I'm right here. I'm standing right here. Well, I've confused it. Alright, I think it's figured something out for me. I haven't figured anything out for it yet, though. Did it kick me? Did it actually manage to kick me? Well, it's not getting stuck in here like I'd hoped. Camera! Thank you, I'm trying to look up at it and you keep pointing down.
No, it's not doing me any good. This is not doing me any good at all. What am I missing here? Like, okay, there's its back, but why can't I get it? I mean, it's not like I can jump that high. It's over there busy with the bunker that I came out of. Oh, there we go. There we go. Now it's looking for me. While it's looking for me, I should be able to jump up and grab that. Ahem. While it's looking for me, I should be able to jump up and... While it's looking for me, I should be able to jump up and... While it's looking for me, I should be able to jump up and grab that. There we go! Now it knows. I mean, you, you did this yourself, man. You know, if this Colossus is just... Oh, crap. It's got a collar here I can't get around. I bet I'm going to have to climb up these goatees of it. I don't know. Let's find out. First off... Uh, you know what? I actually probably am going to have to do something with that. Okay, so I gotta figure out some way of getting. Ah, there we go. I see a spot on its neck. And that's going to lead to. that. He's not a happy... He is not a happy titan. Am I inside its head? Where am I? Physics! So I think I got punted inside its head for a little while there. Shake, shake, shake. Wait for it. There we go. Nope, nope, it's gonna pump me off again. Wow! <sighs> this thing shakes too much. Don't you dare go flying off, you. go. That's where I want it. You know, I appreciate the amount of detail it put into with the whole tumbling around and 
constantly trying to get your grip thing, but it, it does make this game significantly more annoying to play. Yeah, as long as this spot doesn't move, I should have this. No, 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 no. Don't fall off. I'm trying to recover my grip right now. There we go. Got it. All right. I like the fact that it gives little hints, too, if you're lost and trying to figure it out. Yep. So I did manage to kill this in the time limit. So we're going to see the next cutscene. Then I'll save it again after... Actually, I'll just save it before the cutscene and go, maybe. camera is just strange in this like that. It's like, where am I? Why am I here? Why am I right here? Why doesn't it put me somewhere else so we can do the cutscene? No. It's gonna have me have the cutscene where you can't see me because your camera is focused on part of the thing. Colossus. There. Words. Words are hard! Yeah, we'll see the cutscene. I'll run down. Save and we'll have to play tomorrow. I'm having fun with this game. You'll you'll see me stumbling around quite a bit. Trying to figure out where the next step is. But that's part and parcel with puzzle games. Because you gotta figure out the path to take. It's not always obvious. And you'll also note this game is escalating in difficulty. Like I said, that first one was really a tutorial on how to beat the Titans. The second one was a, okay, now you kind of have the idea, but now we're going to introduce that there are two things you have to do. And that third one, of course, showing now you have to get some strategies for how to get on the thing. So that's really good. That's good game design the progression that's going on so far. I can also definitely see spe people speedrunning this game. Misty Lake. Yeah, the lake one. So this this might be... Yeah, to reach is no easy task. This might be the one that got me stuck before, which, as Shark was saying, it's a tough one. It's, it's one that can make or break this game for people course the fact that I was on a time limit because it wasn't my game didn't help I was just borrowing it for a little bit so far though other than how loose these controls are and I get why they are the amount of detail in the characters animation the horse animation you know how I stumble around and all despite the fact that in the previous one I did end up going through the thing's head at one point it's pretty intensive a lot of work went into this and you can see that when you play a lot of work went into this game and tomorrow we will continue it until then and now I did, I'm going to say tonight at some point I will be playing XCOM 2 for my side stream again since Z is not playing it tonight or tomorrow night, I'm going to go ahead and pick up the slack. Besides, I really want to play XCOM. Such a good game. So, I will have that tonight. But then tomorrow, we'll continue with this game and see if I can get four more, or at least a couple more of these Colossus down. Until then, I hope everyone has enjoyed. I hope you like the new layout. I know there's a lot of black, empty space on this side. But it used to be that there was black empty space on both sides, and this space actually does get used a little bit now. So, yeah, you can take it or leave it. Till then, Internet, take care and enjoy the games you play.